Hi and assalamualaikum to all the panels that will be judging my presentation. Thank you so much for allocating your precious time to assess my final year project proposal and presentation. I hope that this presentation will enlighten all the panels on my final year project, which titled F1 in School, a good timing system. Before we start, a little bit of self-introduction. Uh, my name is Muhammad Hafiz bin Muhammad Fauzi. Uh, my student ID is 2020-611 and 712. I was supervised by Dr. Nozaki bin Ehsan as well as Mr. Tajudin Majahi as the co-supervisor. By the end of the presentation, if any of the panels had questions regarding the project, please do not hesitate to contact me via the, via the WhatsApp platform or email me via the email provided. Without further ado, let's start the presentation. This is the abstract for the project. The project was to design a gate timing system for F1 in school competition that are cheaper and simpler for testing F1 in school co computer edit design, uh, sorry, computer edit design and Arduino IDE will be used to design the system and assemble it into one point pieces. By designing the gate timing system, uh, it enables students to perform tests and research for the improvement, the improvement for their car by comparing the time displayed within specific distance. This project used computer modeling and experimental testing to improve the stability of the group for both electronics and mechanical to improvise the gate timing system. A big introduction uh, regarding my project. It is related with F1 in school. What is F1 in school? F1 in school is a global competition that aims to encourage students to pursue uh, careers in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, or famously known as STEM. Competition was launched in UK in 2000 uh, and has since expanded to many countries around the world. It is organized in collaboration with Formula One and other partners and provides students with the opportunity to design and build miniature F1 cars and compete against each other in time frames. The goal of the competition is to promote the STEM education as well as inspire students to learn about the aerodynamic of F1 cars. For the problem statement, there are two major problems seen in the current group of the gate timing system manufactured by Denford, which is one of the major partners for F1 in school competition. The first problem is that the current available gate timing system for F1 in school was too expensive. A simpler cheaper version with a better accuracy can be built. The second problem is that the current gate timing system provide, uh, provide limited data. The sensors was only placed at front and finish gate, which, which just give a single number number for the time. The sensor at the start gate will start the timer, whereas uh, the sensor at the finish gate will stop the timer. From the list of problem statements, two objectives were aimed in order to succeed in eliminating the problems. The first objective is to develop and fabricate an affordable F1 in school kit timing system that can be purchased by school to educate as well as test their car. Second objective is to improvise in terms of build and performance in a simple way compared to current ready build F1 kit timing system in my cat. Research, uh, research and study was made to fully understand in depth of the current possible situation. That can be made to solve the problem. Here are some uh, of the literary that we that will review uh, and could help in designing the gate timing system. Uh, there are F1 in school competition to promote STEM uh, aerodynamic investigation of miniature F1 in school car. The working principle of an Arduino uh, Arduino Inventors Guide. Also, uh, weather monitoring system using IoT with Arduino attention. There are a lot more literary reference that have been used in the project, uh, and it is included uh, in the proposal. The methodology used to approach was fairly simple and straightforward. At the start, problem statement was analyzed thoroughly uh, on the design, and then the next. Uh, is to perform research uh, to seek information uh, which can solve the problem. And 
them by reviewing credible literature solutions to the problem can be brainstormed uh, and list out. The next phase would be to choose the best solution with the help and suggestion from supervisor. On step five, once discussed thoroughly, a uh, design can started to be made and once complete, uh, complete testing, and once complete, uh, testing will be performed to evaluate the project. If in case the outcome fails, it will go back to the previous step, which is step six, to develop and design the prototype back until it passed the test and evaluation. This is the implementation uh, for the project. The approach to fabricate the game timing system is divided into three phases. Phase one consists of electronics. This phase covers all the electronic part, which include both coatings and the circuit layout, as well as choice of hardware. Once the circuit and coding function well, then we'll be go to the next phase, which was the mechanical phase. This phase covers the whole of the kit after all the electronic parts are done, which includes fabrication of sheet metal. Based on the circuit layout, the kit will be designed to fit the circuit into it. This goes for the sensors and other hardware as well. Uh, for the final phase, uh, for the final phase, uh, it will test the fully developed product whether it's functioning or not. This phase will be completed a month earlier in order to save time for correction and any possible improvisation. There are two expected results of the project, which can be divided into mechanical and uh, electronics results. The mechanical results are expected to achieve once the kit is steady, as well as able to store the circuits and sensors in it. It should also not exceeding the cost suggested so that we can maintain the project cost that is user friendly. From this figure, this is a, this is a first sketch that will be made uh, for the gate timing system. However, there, there, there are possible changes uh, that depends on the circuit itself. The result expected to begin in the aspect of electronics is that it should function as planned in the flow chat. It should be able to perform specific tasks, pushing the buttons necessary, displaying the needed times, as well as storing data in a place where the data can be reviewed and accessible by public. And here is the flow chart to show how the system is going to work and the log and all of the loops inside it. In conclusion, the purpose of this project was to design a gate timing system for use in F1 in school composition that is both affordable and easy to use for testing F1 in school cars. By using computer aided design and the Arduino IDE platform, the system was able to be designed as a cohesive one. The gate timing system allows students to conduct tests and research ways to improve their cars by comparing the times displayed over specific distance. Both computer modeling and experimental testing were utilized in order to improve the stability and reliability of the system, both mechanically and electronically. Overall, this project aimed to create a gate timing system that is efficient and effective for use in F1 in school competition. That's that all for me. Uh, thank you so much for hearing till the end.